S7, Russia's second largest airline, has stopped all flights on their Airbus A321neo aircraft. The airline claims that the jets are being prepared for the summer season, though Russian social media channels suggest that the grounding is a result of engine problems. In this video, we're going to talk about big Airbus A321 news. The video is going to be amazing, so make sure you stick to the end. S7 Airlines is Russia's second biggest airline. It has a relatively large fleet, but has struggled with the sanctions imposed. While well, engine issues are not an entirely unfeasible reason for a grounding of the fleet, given sanctions levied as a result of Russia's war of aggression against Ukraine, S7 Airlines denies that it has grounded the planes. The carrier says that they are simply undergoing scheduled maintenance ahead of the summer schedule, while the Russian social media aviation reporting account says that the reason behind the A321 news being taken out of rotation is due to maintenance issues of the Pratt & Whitney Pure Power PW1100G JM GTF engines that power them. However, the airline officially denies that it has crowded the eight jets, stating that the higher capacity narrow bodies have simply been sent to schedule maintenance to prepare for a busy summer season ahead. Various seasons have been thrown out why the airline decided to ground the units, one of the more notable surrounds, the airline preparing for the upcoming summer season. By grounding the units now, they can ensure that the series is readily available during the busier months of travel. However, other reports indicate an engine problem with the plane prevents them from operating. As quoted by Russian state media TASS, a spokesperson for S7 stated, S7 Airlines did not stop flights of Airbus A321 new aircraft traditionally in winter, Part of the aircraft fleet undergoes scheduled maintenance to prepare for the high summer season. Increased capacity aircraft are in demand on fewer flights due to a seasonal decrease in demand. According to plane spotters, S7 owns 8 A321 Neos, 7 of them currently operational. Flight radar data shows that all of them stopped performing flights by January 16, 2023, in some cases even earlier. Aviation-focused Russian telegram channel Frequent Flyers was the first to spot this trend. According to the channel's post, the A321 Neos were placed on the airline's routes with A321 COs and A320 Neos. The channel claims S7 is experiencing problems with Pratt & Whitney engines mounted on the aircraft, arguing that other Russian airlines which operate A321 Neos with CFM engines did not ground their fleets. S7 responded to the allegations on the evening of January 26, saying that the aircraft in question are not grounded but are in fact being prepared for the next season. Before we move on, support us by hitting subscribe and the bell icon to get notified when we post new videos. Now let's get back to our topic. Indeed, it has not been smooth sailing for A321neo operators with a Pratt & Whitney power plant option. Since the engine entered service, there have been a number of small incidents that have taken aircraft out of action for some time. In the pre-pandemic months of 2020, Turkish Airlines granted three of its Pratt & Whitney A321neos. Indigo, one of the world's biggest customers of the time, has experienced far over 20 engine failures across its A321neo fleet since 2016. No wonder the airline went with the LEAP-1A for its massive order of 310 new Airbus narrow bodies in 2021. Along with the other Russian airlines, S7 is a subject of export sanctions from the US and the EU. Airbus aircraft operated by the airline are not supported by the manufacturer since the sanctions were announced in the aftermath of Russia's full-scale invasion of Ukraine. S7 received their A321neos between 2017 and 2021. All the aircraft were leased and the airline did not return them to lessons as recommended by the Russian government. The jets were re-registered in Russia in April 2022. Since then, some Russian airlines including S7 legalized the commandeered aircraft by officially buying them from the lessers. However, it's unclear if the A321neos in question have been purchased in this way, as 7 Airlines says that a typical winter grounding allows the planes to be inspected and prepped for the summer. Furthermore, they claim that the drop-off in demand to fly during the winter season allows them to ground the type. But if S7 wants to save the engines from wear and tear ahead of a summer season with no official spare parts, it makes sense to not operate the aircraft, whether one refers to this as grounding or not. So that's it. Please like, share, and comment with your thoughts below if you like this video. Remember to subscribe to see our next video. Stay safe, and we'll be back soon with another video just for you guys. Until then, take care, stay safe, and be happy, guys.